ABS training. Accessing ABS codes. The Alphamut with ABS is equipped with integrated ABS diagnostics and can access and clear ABS fault codes. The Alphamut allows the technician to access ABS diagnostics via the LCD screen on the control panel or software app on the tablet. Manual controls. In this method, the user must use both the press function and the turn function of the control knob to access various menus and read through ABS troubleshooting information that is available within the LCD screen. Once the tester is turned on and ABS is detected, you can turn the upper control knob to cycle through menus or submenus. Press the control knob to access the submenus. The Alphamut communicates with the trailer's ABS ECU in real time via IPA's proprietary internal ABS PLC communication module. This communication is automatically activated as long as the ABS or auxiliary circuit is selected or powered up by the Alphamut. Once activated, the ABS module will send information requests to the trailer's ECU. The trailer's ECU will automatically broadcast back to the ECU make, model, VIN, and mileage along with other basic information. This information is then stored inside the internal computer of the Alphamut. When fault codes or clear fault commands are requested, the ABS PLC communication module will send the command to the trailer's ECU. The user must then request fault codes again to verify that there are no active faults. Each Alphamut provides ABS data status lights, which indicate the status of information either being sent to the trailer in the form of commands or information being broadcasted from the trailer to the tester. When troubleshooting ABS connectivity issues, it is imperative for the technician to view these status LEDs. Failing to view the status LEDs could result in false assumptions, such as a faulty ABS computer, broken ABS lights, and others. Accessing Active Faults With the Active Faults submenu 1 selected and the active SID and FMI codes displayed, turn the control knob clockwise to cycle through fault codes. Press the control knob to read the fault description. Accessing Stored Faults With the Stored Faults submenu 2 selected and the stored SID and FMI codes displayed, turn the control knob clockwise to cycle through fault codes. Press the control knob to read the fault description. Clear All Codes With the Clear All Codes submenu 3 selected, the screen will display Clear, No or Yes. Turn the control knob to yes or no depending on your desire. Press the control knob to make your selection. Tablet controls. In this method, the ECU information, clear faults command, code definitions, and troubleshooting information are all displayed on one screen. The ABS app can be found on the home screen of the tablet. Press the ABS icon to launch the app. With the Alphamut powered on, ensure it is paired with the tablet via Bluetooth. Select ABS or Auxiliary Circuit 1 on the tester's face. Press Request ABS ECU Information to populate the make, model, serial, trailer VIN, trailer mileage, and ABS lamp status fields. The ABS circuit status light will illuminate green, and the battery voltage field will also populate. Press Request Faults to populate the lower portion of the screen with any active or stored faults. Press Troubleshooting Info located in the Cause area to show additional information for each fault. Failure Mode Identifier Assignments The Failure Mode Identifier FMI, describes the type of failure detected in the subsystem identified by the PID or SID. The FMI and either the PID or SID combine to form a given diagnostic code. The remaining failure mode identifiers would be assigned by the SAE Truck and Bus Low Speed Communications Network Subcommittee. 
if additional common failure modes become detectable. 